Hello and welcome to a new moving vlog. Um, today is Saturday. I am going to go and get my nails done. Look how bad these are. I've got a crack in this one as well. So I got these done before Milan. Um, they're actually still all right though. Like they haven't grown out that much, but I'm just worried about that one with the crack in. And normally I get them done every three weeks and it's been three weeks since last time I got them done. So I'm off to go and get my nails done. It is, wait, let me have a look at the time. It's four o'clock. In the afternoon i had a little bit of a lie in this morning i was woken up by builders outside as per i'm just going to shut these windows because i'm going to go out also i went to matalan today i'll show you once i get back from doing my nails but i went to matalan today and i got some like nice little cushions to put on my sofa because basically my sofa is getting delivered on monday which is good and then obviously like i said in last week's vlog well i only said it yesterday but it would have been last week's vlog for you um i am going to sort these out today because they desperately need sorting out so i'm going to sort out these drawers and just basically pop everything that's going on over here in drawers because yeah it's a bit of a mess so that's what i'm gonna go and do today um it's currently raining outside so the weather is not the best and also i need to tidy up as well like i need to just give everywhere a little bit of a hoover i've also done my assignment today i went to cafe nero to do some of my assignment I didn't vlog it because it's probably the most boring thing in the world but yeah that's what i've done so far today that's why i've picked up my vlogging camera so late the nail shop shuts at half six i think so fingers crossed i can get them done it's like four o'clock now but i'm just hoping it's not busy because i just i can't deal with like waiting for like two hours to get my nails done so i'm gonna see how busy it is anyway and then i will pop back on and we'll sort out whatever is going on currently in my living room i promise time has passed mainly because i'm soaked um but i went out i didn't get my nails done as you can see because it was like way too busy so i just thought i'd end up going either like next week in the week or see what it's like tomorrow just as they open at 11 but oh, <gasps> this primark bag is literally soaked so basically i went shopping so i thought i'd do a little haul because in my head i'm saying that you all love my little shopping hauls so i got myself some radox bubbles because i'm gonna have a bath tonight instead of a shower i think so i got radox got some cotton buds because i've been like pottering around thinking oh i wish i had a cotton bud so i just bought them 99p from body care and then i got some more deodorant very uninteresting haul this by the way um primark just completely uninteresting i got these little workout shorts for five pounds i got these from nottingham but i got them in a size 12 and they were just weren't baggy enough so i swapped them for a 14 and then i got some black bed shorts because I'm on my period at the moment, to put it bluntly. So I need some black ones just for bed because the other ones are pink and white. And if you're a girl, you know that's not a good mix. So yeah, basically that is what I got. I'm going to make myself some... Well, it's going to be like lunch. I'm staying up tonight to watch WWE. So I normally like order something when I'm watching that. So I'm going to make some like lunch slash tea but i haven't had any lunch and it is granted it's five past five so um i think i'm gonna make salmon on toast that could be a contender Hello, this is my tea I meant to have toast with it but um yeah, it was mouldy. I knew I should have got some more bread. But yeah, I've got these salmon strip things from Aldi. So I've got them. I've made my famous scrambled eggs. And then the sausages needed to be eaten by today. So I've just paired it with some sausages. Look how good that looks. So chuffed. I honestly can't tell you how excited I am that I chose a flat that has a bath and a shower. Because all I want right now is a bath. I've got my Redox in, as you can see. And I'm going to relax. I am vlogging on my phone because my vlogging, oh yeah, my vlogging camera 
I didn't tell you about the cannon. The Chris the cannon is done. So I'm using my DSLR, but I didn't want to bring that out with me. So we're at the garden centre. Look how nice. We're going to buy some plants. We've just been for some lunch. Lunch was really nice. Look at all this. There's a little love heart there as well. So cute. Look how nice all these little roses are. It's so sunny as well. Guys and girls, I ended up picking. This is my plant. Em, show you your plant. <laughs> I would just like to say we're not a cool mum. We're a plant mum. <laughs> no, we're a cool plant mum. Hello. It has been a few days since I last vlogged. Today it is... What day is it today? Tuesday? Wednesday? Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday. I don't even... This is what I mean. I don't even know what day it is. What day is it? It is Wednesday. I'm just living my days right now. So yeah, there has been some really exciting furniture bits that have come. I haven't vlogged in a couple of days because it's been chocker. It has been mental. There is a little story about my sofa. So my sofa actually got delivered and this is the bad boy over here. How beautiful is this sofa? I also got a new rug. This is from b &M, it was 45 I think. If I can find it on the B&M website, I'll leave it down below. I'll also leave this sofa down below as well. But obviously it's a three-seater sofa and I had to try and fit it through this door, which was really fun when you're living on your own. I had to get my mum round and my mum and sister helped me get this upstairs. Three flights of stairs later and I ended up getting a massive bruise on my arm. So that's how my day's going. Also, you may have seen my new plant that I got from the garden centre is down here with my TV. This coffee table is actually going to move here. I got my TV stand, which is over there. I got that delivered from Ikea yesterday. So I need to put that up, put that where the TV is, and then this is gonna go on here. But I think it looks really nice. I don't know if I can zoom out anymore. No, I can't zoom out anymore, but I think this looks really nice next to the sofa. Oh, also, I finally managed to get a mirror. So I wanted the Nisidal, I'll leave it down below, um, mirror from Ikea. And the only thing was, Ikea delivery was like 40 quid. And I was like, I'm not spending 40 quid delivery on a mirror there's only 55 pounds anyway but i couldn't find the same mirror anywhere for less than the price of the mirror plus delivery so i just had to buy it and get delivery on it but this is the mirror i don't know i'm not going to keep it here because it's like next to this wall but it is nice and big which is good so i can actually plan out my outfit my jeans by the way are from Pretty Little Thing. I'll also leave these down below. And then I've just got bits and pieces going on here. This is the plant that I also got from the garden centre when I went with M's. And then I have started to kind of put everything in my drawers. Look how organised this all is. I need to finish putting my clothes in my drawers, obviously, but I've got a couple more storage boxes. As you can see from Wilco's here, these are so good they're little underbed storage boxes for £4.50 and then I got this it's like an ottoman um but it's like a it says Vela Velour I can't say it but yeah um so that needs putting up that needs to go in the recycling it's the last bit of recycling that I have but when I went down last night the other bin was locked so that is basically what's happening it's literally seven o'clock in the evening and I've just finished work I've got a banging headache and I just want my toasty. So we're gonna make a toasty. I don't know why I always do the peace sign. Like it's actually annoying. Exciting news in the Becker household. I got a panini grill yesterday. TJ Hughes, $19.99. What an absolute bargain. So I'm gonna make myself, I like making myself a toasty in a panini grill. I bet you probably will make you what? But I think it like toasts it better than a sandwich maker. Trust me on this, it will change your life. I'm gonna go and make a toasty. And probably sit on my couch and eat it because my couch is chef's, <laughs> oh, that's me blowing a kiss, chef's kiss. Hello, good morning. I haven't vlogged in a few days, I know I haven't. Today is Sunday. Um, I do know that I was supposed to get this vlog up today, but I feel like 
I need to vlog a little bit more over the next few days and then get it uploaded. Let me show you my outfit. I'm not doing anything fancy, by the way. I'm literally just going, I don't know if I can zoom this out anymore. No, I can't. I'm just going to um, do some food shopping first this morning. So I'm wearing this top from Primark. The cycling shorts are from Pull and Bear. Yeah, Pull and Bear. And then my shoes are just my night dunk. So I'm just wearing something like really casual, comfy. You know the vibe. So yeah, it's a little bit messy in here because I went out on Friday night and I didn't know what to wear. So we're going to deal with that today. Um, also, I did some washing yesterday. So that was all done. Um, I have a really exciting parcel from Cherries as well, which I'm going to go through. Cherries really, really kindly sent me this Mahusiv parcel which I can't wait to open because it's got all like essentials in which is going to be perfect because obviously I'm just new. And yeah, the couch is doing okay. Like I like just being able to sit on the couch and chill. This has gone down a little bit. Need to sort that out today. Today is the sorting out today. Don't know if I vlogged my rug. I got this rug, by the way, from b and I think I said I'd leave it down below. I'm not sure if I've vlogged it, but I just think it looks really, really nice. I got some... Homeware bits from Primark. And yeah, today is just going to be a sorting out day um, because last week there was a lot on with getting my assignment done. Work was hectic. So in my evening, I didn't basically have my evenings to be able to like tidy up and clean up. I literally would finish work and go have tea and go to bed. But today we're going to be doing a food shop. So I'm going to go to Aldi, do a little bit of a food shop. If I do end up vlogging, it will be on my phone because I'm not taking this Mahusiv camera with me. Desperately need to do a food shop, so that's what I'm gonna go and do now. I'm not sure if anyone cares about my food shop, but if for any crazy miracle you do, I just thought I would pop on and show you what I got from Aldi, because today was Aldi shopping day. My hair looks a mess, I look a mess. I need a shower ASAP, but... I got some apple juice. I got Aldi versions of Magnums because I'm loving Magnums at the moment. So I got them because they're so much cheaper than the actual version. Mini rolls. Some Crave cereal, which is Aldi's version called Craze. Because this morning all I wanted was Crave. So I got it. Aldi chicken korma. Actually pretty like this. I have, have pretty like this. I had that last week. I like it. Um, had the carbonara as well from Aldi, so I got another one of them. This is what I'm gonna have tonight, duck pancakes. So excited, it says serves two. But I was thinking, if I like put it all in and just cook it, then I can have like the cold duck on butties tomorrow for lunch. Stuffed crust pizza. I'm making my way around pizza in supermarkets at the moment to try to find the best because I'm so picky. Some beef burgers, I need to get some buns from Iceland because I like their buns, but I got beef burgers anyway. Bacon to have with my sausages. I like these sausages. Got them the other week, top tier. And then that's gonna be for a fry up because I've got some chopped tomatoes as well because I like to have chopped tomatoes. So this is my Aldi order. So here guys and girls, we have my Aldi order. It came to like 25 pounds, I think, which is similar to last time. So four a week's worth of shopping pretty much that is a week's worth we're doing okay i need like ham and stuff but i've already got cheese and bread so that's a meal in itself as well hello i look a lot more different a lot more put together um as you're watching this the video that i've just filmed will fingers crossed hopefully be up i'll be very surprised if it's not um but i'm just gonna show you kind of a little sneak peek if you haven't watched the video by the way i will leave it down below but it was a pretty little thing haul so i've been waiting to kind of show this pretty little thing haul but i was waiting to film like an actual video on it i got this bed cover how cute is this i got a few little prints as well that i need to frame i got this which i've been wanting one of these for ages i got a throw um I think that was pretty much everything. It looks really, really nice. And I can't wait to finally use it now. Um, also need to tidy this room. As you can see, this is basically what happened when I went out on Friday. Had a little bit of a stress, a little bit of a meltdown. So we need to sort that out because we're not about that life anymore. And yeah, I'm having duck wraps for tea. I can't wait. I'm gonna take off this makeup. I need to tidy up. 
and tidying up in makeup is not a vibe. Also, how nice is this top? Let me show you. Can we just appreciate that this is the most that I've vlogged in like a week? <laughs> um, so I got this top from H&M. I got this yesterday. Um, I'm just wearing a little bralette from Misguided underneath. You can also see my little rib tattoo, which never makes an appearance. But yeah, this top is stunning. I've been wanting this for so long, but I wasn't sure how it would look. Um, but I absolutely love this. Could you imagine this with jeans? Like, I wouldn't go out with, like, cycling shorts, but I was just wearing them today anyway. And then, obviously, I've been filming, so I just put this on the top because you obviously can't see the bottom. But I love this top. So, like I said, I will leave it down below. 110%. Uh, also, need to get my other camera fixed because I haven't sent it off yet. I know, how terrible. Um, but firstly, we're going to have a little tidy up. A little sort out, I need to have a shower tonight as well. I'm going to put in a little clip from the hairdressers, but I went to the hairdressers on Thursday, so my hair is all nice. Look at that, no dead ends. It's still pretty long as well, she cut off a couple of inches, but it's still looking pretty long, pretty nice. So yeah, right, going to sort my life out and get tidy. I'm just about to sit down and watch Twilight, but look how good this looks. This was the duck pancakes that I got from... Aldi, I got this one. Got it all laid out. I'm so buzzing. I love this tea so much. I forgot about it. And then when I saw it in Aldi, I was like, I need to have it. Hello, only me, queen of badly vlogging. Oh, by the way, I don't know if I vlogged this, but I put this up all by myself. So this is what it's currently looking like in this section. I've been sat on the couch, which is why it's been messy, but you can see throw on there my pillows. Um, I've moved this onto here. There's Sanchez presents because it's her birthday tomorrow so I'm going home for that. I got this from Primark, literally two pounds, also come down with a cold, hence the tissues. And then my TV stand, my little plant oh, is over there. Anyway, moving on to the reason why I was going to vlog. My massive cherries order. Woo! Skizzes. So, um, I just thought, I don't know, did I vlog this the other day? I can't remember. Um, I just thought I would pop on and go through some bits that Cherry is very, very kindly gifted me. Honestly, it came at the best time because I actually emailed them and was like, oh my God, perfect timing. I've just moved out and there's so much that I need now that I've moved out. So it's just a lot of paper. <gasps> I forgot I picked these up. I was literally sat on my couch like I need Doritos. So basically, if you don't know what cherries are, cherries basically have, like when I went on there, I was like, oh my God, there's so much stuff. Like it's not just like homeware stuff, they do like photo frames and they're like little bits and pieces. So especially if you're living on your own, have a little look on the cherries app. Um, I have got a discount code as well. So I will leave that on the screen. Hold on, let me get the discount code so I can actually say it. I'm gonna sneeze, I've got a cold, life ain't chilling. Don't forget, you spell Jane with a Y. Woo. I will leave it down below as well. <gasps> it didn't just give me one measuring jug, it's a two pack of measuring jugs. So I needed the measuring jug because I like making scrambled eggs and currently I'm whisking it in a bowl, which ain't the worst thing you can whisk in a bowl, but the measuring jug is always handy to have. And then <gasps> these are going straight in the fridge. Caramel nibbles. <sighs> oh. <laughs> I got some Ritz crackers if my sister is watching this. Well, she likes Tuck Biscuits. Actually, I think my dad is more of a Ritz fan. So, dad, if you're watching this, are you proud of me? Oh, I got some bin liners. I'm going through the years like God knows what at the moment because obviously moving in, there's like so much rubbish. So, thank God I've got some of these. Also, I've got some Pringles. I saw these in B&M and I had no hands to get them. So, when I did my cherries order, I was like, it's so much easier because cherries just delivered to your house. So, I don't have to worry about it any of that there's like little bits of everything i've got toilet cleaner sounds boring but i'm telling you when you live on your own stuff like this makes you so excited and then i've got some duracell batteries once again massive necessity got some <gasps> got some fairy lights that i need to put on so then um, got some chewing gum i'm gonna put that in my drawer because you never know when you might need it Got some twirls. 
when I was doing my cherry all day, I realised that I'd run out of twirls, and I love twirls, so these are going in the fridge. I put my chocolate in the fridge, okay? Chocolate deserves to go in the fridge. I got this. This is a Mr. Muscle oven cleaner. You never know when you're going to need oven cleaner. Sorry, I've got a cold, which is why I keep running my nose. Definitely need this. I want to keep my oven nice and clean. And then, what's this one? See, I just remember that I got, like, absolute essentials that I was like, if I did a shop, I would not be able to carry this on my own. Oh, I got Bondi Sands Self Tanning Mist in dark. This is what I mean. Cherries do some of the most, like, weird and wonderful things on the app. Like, you get your homeware, like, your necessities, and then you've got stuff like this, which is a nice, not necessity, but it's a nice thing to have. What are these? Oh! some glasses i think these are wine glasses so basically it's my birthday soon and i'm hoping to like have some friends around no one really came to my birthday last year but that's another story for another day but i am gonna have a flat warmer as well which is why i got these yeah i got these as well i think that's pretty much everything like i'm not gonna lie I am absolutely so buzzed. Like, could you imagine getting this every month if you, like, I think even if you, like, live with someone else, it's still, like, so exciting to get. So let me show you all of it. So these are all the bits that I got from Cherries. Once again, thank you so much for gifting all these. Like, everything is such an essential for, like, living on my own and just getting a new place and... I am probably most excited about my Mr. Muscle and my toilet cleaner. And also, I've been needing batteries for a long time, so I'm so glad that I've got these batteries as well. I got a AAA and AA because you never know when you might need them. So thank you so much, Terry. Like I did say, I have got a discount code, so I will leave it down there. Or once again, I'll pop it on screen. Just in case you kind of want to have a little look and see what's on there. Like even just going on the app and having a browse and seeing what's on there. It's so easy as well if you've just moved or if you kind of live in like a small apartment and I don't drive so I struggle when I go shopping I need to get my absolute essentials because other things like even though I love like oven cleaner and toilet cleaner and stuff they're quite heavy to take in a bag on my own so having something like cherries which literally delivers to my door it was so much easier because I didn't have to trek 10 miles to Aldi and then back and yeah it's just so much easier being able to like do your order on the app what's not to love also I know I sound like death all my plants are doing really well do, did I show my other plants that I got well I put them in here put them in the bathroom so these are my other plants got them on here I don't know if I vlogged that but yeah they're just chilling in the bathroom at the moment so the plan is I'm out of focus so I'm hoping it'll go back and focus soon. The plan is that I'm going to put all the stuff that I got from Cherries away because it's currently on my floor. <laughs> so put that away. And then I'm going to have a shower. I'm going to fake tan. Probably going to watch the rest of The Walking Dead finish off this season. Well, this season up until now, I think they're releasing some more. And then just chill because, like I said, I've got a bit of a cold. And then I'm going home tomorrow for Sanchez's birthday. So I will probably vlog that. I've got a present just chilling on here. My nose is so red. <gasps> Everyone feel sorry for me. Hello, I'm having a bit of a tidy up day. So this is going to be the last day of the vlog. So I thought I would just vlog today. I have been out. I got some bits and pieces, which I will show you. I got this bag from the charity shop. I'll show you properly later. How gorgeous. I need it to replace one of my other bags that's literally just frayed and nearly broken. So, yeah, got all that. Also, it's way too hot today, and you can tell. I know this is so disgusting and so TMI, but, like, I feel like no one understands unless you're a girl with boobs. <laughs> because now I'm going to have to change out this bodysuit and change into a top because I need to go to Iceland. This would have been a nice OOTD if it wasn't for that, but anyway, nevertheless. I have also cleared the massive TV cardboard box and all the recycling from here, put that downstairs. I have got this to put up tonight though, which is gonna be for freestanding clothes rail that needs to go up. So that's what I'm gonna to do tonight. What's that? I think this box just, I don't know. I'm gonna change my t-shirt. I'm gonna to go to Iceland because I need some bread. I need some milk um, and it shuts at four. So I think I need to like 
get a scoot on and go and then I'll show you what I've got and stuff and just have a bit of a tidy up but first like I said I need bread because I want a toasty and I'm hungry and I've had no lunch. Currently just putting up my clothing rail. We'll see how well I do this but so far I am not too bad at putting up furniture so I'll let you know how it goes. Guys, I did it. It's literally taken me 15 minutes and I've put up my clothing rail all by myself. Look, I've actually done it. Zero help. That was the easiest thing I have put up. Honestly, you didn't need any tools or anything. You just slot everything into place. And here it is. Well done, Becca. Shall we all laugh at me trying to put my prints on the wall behind me straight because it ain't gonna happen because of my eyes. Okay, this is stressful. <sighs> put one. Yeah. Gotta love command strips. One down. Woo! Okay, now time for print number two. These were from Home Bargains, by the way. I think they were like three pounds each with the frame. I'm pretty sure they came with the frame. But yeah, I'm gonna put this one on. Woo! Oh, you know how I can get it straight? Mm. Measuring tape. So hopefully, if I use this bad boy. Oh, no, it's blocking. Oh. Oh. So why do I think I'm gonna have a look and it's not gonna be straight? Oh, that was pretty good. Here we go, guys and gals. Just put the ears on top. Sorry, I've just done the washing, so I need to pair them up. How good does that look? Let me show you from this angle. Like, walk into the flat. Still a bit messy over here, but I've got my clothing rail now. Got my TV and stuff in there here. Love it. Hello, I just thought I would end this vlog. I've just had a shower, as you can see. I'm in my bathroom, which is quite exactly. I've tanned as well, so I just thought I would end this vlog as I'm tanning my face. I got this from Bondi Sands. They kind of gifted this me. It's the Sunny Days SPF 50 Moisturiser. Normally, I put this on before I tan my face. I was just checking it was recorded. And I used it for the first time the other day, and when I was using that, I was like, like my face feels quite nice like i have dry skin anyway so and i don't know oh i got it oh i got it everywhere i don't normally use moisturizer either so it's literally everywhere <laughs> well done becca it's fine that's what tanning evenings are for and it just i just like to put it on moisturize my face and it just gives like a nice base before i put my tan face tan on because i never used to tan my face and my sisters used to not bully me for it obviously but they were like you need to tan your face and i agree i need to tan my face but this gives a nice face does anyone even care also i probably need to spritz my plants before i go to bed because it was like 30 degrees today and it's been quite humid in here so i'm just thinking that most likely they're gonna need a little bit of a spritz and then i go in and use this from St. Moritz, face and body tanning mist in media. It's fast drying. You can get this from Home Bargains if you've got Home Bargains near you. And if not, then how do you cope without a Home Bargains? They might sell it in BM actually. I think they might sell it in BM as well. Don't judge how many times I spray it. I sprayed it a few times the other day because it was the first time I've used this. I did use another one, but I don't know where it's gone. Uh, it is in the bag somewhere. Um, so I sprayed it a few times and I didn't go completely orange. Actually, I didn't really go orange at all, so we're just gonna go with it. <laughs> completely missed. Oh, it smells so nice. If I end up like an unplumper tomorrow, then you won't see it because I'm not vlogging next week. No, that was what I was gonna say. I won't be vlogging next week because basically I sent Chris the cannon. What's that called, Colin? The Colin. I thought his name was Chris. His name's Chris or Colin, I can't remember. But my vlogging camera, I went into the camera shop today and I sent him off. He's going for much needed surgery. Hoping he'll come back. He's got a few screws loose, quite literally just got a few screws loose. So I'm hoping I'll get him back by the time it's my birthday, because it's my birthday in a couple of weeks. So I'm hoping to vlog that anyway. Um, but as for the moving vlogs, I've pretty much done everything that I want to do at the moment. So I'm going to wait to get my G7X back before I do another vlog but of course there will be like main channel main channel videos everything's on here anyway there will be normal videos in the interim I'm gonna end this vlog here because I am gonna go to bed I'm gonna 
read some more of my book because I've read quite a bit of my book today. Read some more of my book, go to bed because it's Monday tomorrow, which means another week in work. I always do the peace sign, I hate it. But I really hope that you did enjoy this vlog. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already. And hopefully I'll see you on my next video very, very soon. Bye.